is a TDW case history. Jet fuel line bypass. Mumbai International Airport. Perhaps one of the most dynamic cities on the planet is Mumbai. It is the second largest city in the world and home to nearly 14 million residents. This region of India is enjoying explosive growth fueled by unprecedented levels of international commerce and new business. For most, a visit to Mumbai begins here at the Mumbai International Airport. To keep up with the increasing passenger levels, a variety of developments are underway at the airport. One critical project is the expansion and renovation of the T2 International Terminal. However, the upgrade could not begin until 156 meters of jet fuel piping unseen below the T2 terminal, was relocated. The customer made it clear. Relocate the jet fuel line. Never interrupt the product flow or the daily jet fuel sales worth 140 million rupees each day. This project needed a TDW solution. TDW India was contracted to provide the hot tapping and line intervention services for the jet fuel line relocation project. Work began at the southwest end of the existing fuel line. This location is called tie-in point two. Here you can see the stopple fittings being welded onto the line by TDW welders. The work they are performing is called in-service welding because the pipeline is live. That means jet fuel is flowing through the pipeline even as the TDW welders are working. And remember, jet fuel has a flash point of only 38 degrees centigrade. Next, the three-way spools and sandwich valves are put atop the fittings. An 18-inch branch line is put into position. Now the pipeline is ready for hot tapping. Once the tapping is completed, jet fuel flow through the bypass is established. The TDW tapping machines are removed. Now the TDW crew assembles the stopple machines and then inserts the plugging heads into the existing fuel line. This diagram shows how the jet fuel flow is redirected through the bypass, as indicated by the arrows. The section of pipe between the two stopple machines is cut and removed. This is where the new jet fuel line will tie in. Now you are looking at tie-in point one, the northwest end of the existing fuel line. The procedures previously described also apply to this location. Hot tapping, line plugging, removing a section of old pipe, and the tie-in of the new section of jet fuel line. Finally, the project concludes by withdrawing the plugging heads and starting the flow of jet fuel through the new 156 meter line. TDW India safely and successfully completed this critical work in 60 days, and the supply of jet fuel was never interrupted during this project. For the Mumbai airport, there was no other option than perfection. For this project, there was no other choice than TDW India. Visit the TDW website to see more examples of projects performed by TDW India and TDW Service.